All right, we are here at Harvard University today with jazz musician, although that label hardly fits you. Robert Glasper, how are you? I am doing just fine. I'm how are so you? I'm glad. I'm great. Uh, what brought you to Harvard today? I was doing a master class and uh, talking to the students about what I do and um, had a Q&A with uh, hip hop producer Ninth Wonder, who's also on staff here doing some things. And, and uh, some of the students played and did some critiquing and playing with the students and all that kind of stuff. So just had, hung out with the kids today. And the Wicked Smart kids, they play the good wicked jazz? The Wicked Smart kids that play good <laughs> jazz, yes. That are really going to be doctors. <laughs> you think? But they're just having a good time <laughs> exactly. while they're at it. Exactly. Absolutely. Well, um, for a lot of people, I think jazz is, is kind of scary. It's something that they don't understand. It sounds funny. Mm -hmm. It's only for smart people or mathematicians. Right. But um, and for me, when I first pictured jazz in my head, I picture a guy sitting in a basement with like a black turtleneck. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. Tell me, what is your jazz? Uh, my jazz is uh, not the black turtleneck. It would be this. <laughs> It'd probably be like a hip hop shirt, you know, <laughs> so or something so like clean. that. So fresh and so clean. It's it's just uh, you know my culture now, who I am. You know what I mean? And that's uh, the hip hop culture. You know, so. Uh, a lot of the music I, I produce has a lot of hip-hop in it. Soul music, R&B, but of my time period. And, and rock music of my time period. Like on my latest record, Black Radio, there's Nirvana covers. And right. Radio, I do Radiohead covers and, and Bjork. And, you know, at the same time, I do J. Della stuff and, and you know, floor tree stuff and all, all kinds of stuff that, that's of the music that soundtracks my life. You know? Do you feel like mixing those genres does it come easy? Do you have to like shove it into a big, you know, ninja blender right. and make it work? Or? No, actually, it's very easy. It's it's all natural to me because I played all that all that music all my life. You know what I mean? So it's all it all just comes natural. It'll be harder if I tried to just play one style of jazz or something like that. But um, all that music is natural to me, so it's pretty really easy. I read an uh, interview with you where you were saying that you've gotten bored with jazz. Mm -hmm. Jazz needed. A big giant ass slap. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I'm, I'm asking, is it like Catholic school paddle style? Right. You use a hand. Right. How does that work? Well, like, to make it go? Like, really like a hit to the jaw. <laughs> so I'm just like, bop. No. It just needs something to wake it up. You know what I mean? Because I think a lot of times jazz gets an autopilot, and people tend to just regurgitate the old and not really try to do anything new or cutting edge or mix anything together or you know just make anything interesting anymore. Mm -hmm. So. It just needs that something to make people talk about it. You know right. what I mean? Something like, oh, what, what's that? Even if they talk, even if they're like, I hate that. What is that? <laughs> that just gets it. people talking. It's yeah, weird. exactly. I don't know something. How I feel about that. Something. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. yeah, I downloaded your uh, your new record today, which what it came out in February, but you remixed it. And it's a re re the remix EP. Yep. And yeah. um, you know, the, the first song is like jazz. The second song is a straight up hip hop record. Mm -hmm. Flows throughout. Mm -hmm. I, I, how do you how do you try and get that out there to the masses and say listen to me? Well, it, it has a little <laughs> bit of everything for everybody. So it's really just like once you name all the people on it and and just see what see what it is. I mean, it's it's a it's amazing how it's how it's flown through the the music industry. How many people have gravitated towards Black Radio album, and they all respect all the guests on there. How like Eric Badu and Most Def and right. Lupe Fiasco and you know. Michelle and Degel Cello, Music Soul Child, Chris really, Michelle, really a lot of people. Record. So, yeah, on so. Now. Now, <laughs> <on iTunes. laughs>